Yo, what up, boys? It's your guy Kiwi here, back with another YCL Draft League video. This time, our new league is starting up. This is our very first battle against Coach Kamike uh, and the captain. Well, he is the captain of the Greasy Gujras. All right, so six on the left is my team. Six on the bottom right is his team. I think I'm in a pretty good position coming into this game. Um, I definitely like my comp better than his. Uh, I think Hazards are going to take a big toll on his team potentially with his only defog. No, he brought two defoggers, the Rotom and the Salamence. Um, that being said, what do I think he's going to lead in this scenario? He might go for a Scarf Dormanitan U-turn. Mm. What do I want to do here? So, he's got Rotom and Clefairy as special attackers of four, six potential physical. Um, what am I afraid of in this scenario? Maybe if I went Drapion, just really the... You know what, let's, let's go Rillaboom. Um, you know what, let's just go Glavantula. Set up the webs. We got Specs Curium hoping to hit hard with that thing, man. So, let's see what he does. Seen Bishmi swing crazy. Oko's for days with that Draco Meteor. But, you know, watching my VGC battle last week or this week, guys, well, when you see it, <laughs> you can understand why I'm reluctant to hit Draco Meteor. <laughs> but it's all part of the game, man. Good luck. Have fun, Mr. Kamike. Let's see what these new team comps are about. That's exciting. It's always fun to play the first map. Mm-mm. Oh, he brought Clefairy instead of Celebi. I'm sorry. Clefairy. Oh, that was pretty close. Okay, so Incineroar, I figured. Uh, we're just going to Sticky Web. We should be faster. Okay, fake out. Ooh. Okay. Should I expect that? Okay, we got a World Switch right here. I think he's gonna go for the fire move, right? So let's Volt Switch. And then with that being said, we're going to actually go into Hitman Top for the, the attack drop. There's a knockoff. He predicted the switch. It's fine. We're gonna hit fake out. Something's gotta hold a fake out. I'm not particularly offensive, so this is just a little bit of chip. He might predict a fighting move and hard switch. Not a problem. Let's fix this quick there. Yeah, okay, so there's the hard switch. So he's a bulky little. Now, let's see. Hmm, let's see, play it all. What can you do for me right here? Nobody can hold this water move as much as I'd like. This is gonna suck, actually. Now that he took off my assault vest. What's to say he doesn't click? Let's hit Mach Punch. Just see. It's like toxic. Okay. Okay. Just wanted to see what he would click. 
I wanted to go Drapion. Drapion would have been nice there. Like, actually. And well, let's go Rillaboom, and then we're going to hit Fake Out and Grassy Glide again. He's probably going to go into Incineroar. So, let's see what he does. I think my win con is getting my my hazards up and letting Kyrium just start swinging. But he definitely just brought Clefable just for the Kyrium. So, <laughs> because he doesn't want Draco Meteors to come down. He might even click Hydro Pump right here. Let's see. Okay, Volt Switch. I don't know. I'm playing pretty bad. I'm kind of tired, guys. I'm not going to lie. Tokyo. Who's that? Okay, fine. Okay, so this thing is Moxie. I'm going to fake out. What do I want to do right here? Mm. Generally, Salamence is faster. This is going to be a free Dragon Dance. Could be iffy. I think we have to hit on top. Intimidate. Triple Axel. Okay, there's the Wing Beat. So him on top is definitely not going to take another one. Gonna fake out. Okay, so he swaps. Fairy, okay. This is where Moonblast is free. Or does he click Flamethrower? Hmm. Okay, let's go Drapion right here. Okay, so he sets his rocks. I think he's gonna hard switch. I don't think he saves in for this. So I'm just gonna toxic spike. Nope. Let's see what he goes into. Peeking. That's Incineroar, okay. So Peking probably has the uh, Earthquake, which is fine. A little bulky on the Drapion, I believe it should be. Yes, I'm very bulky. So I'm actually going to layer another Toxic Fight because I am greedy. <laughs> Ooh, that still did a lot of damage. He's really offensive on this thing, huh? You know what, actually? Let's poison jab. Okay, I'm faster. Nice. Black Flood gone. It's fine. Gonna poison jab again.
I don't really want to layer it. Two turns, if I could start hitting. I'm playing way too defensive, I think. There we go. That's what we're doing. Very nice. Earthquake. Oh, overheat. Okay. That's actually pretty good. Mix that. Hmm. I don't think another overheat kills. He might hit earthquake now, but I'm gonna get out the double spikes. Let's see. He's gonna go into something that he can do for on, right? Should have hit the poison down. Is that greedy? Okay, that's fine. Is he gonna hit earthquake? Let's see. Did he hit Earthquake or did he hit Defog? Let's see. Okay, Dragon Ant. Jeez, that's not good. This is pretty bad. Yikes. So what do we do here? I think we just gotta hit Ice Beam and hope for the best. What does he play? A max HP, max special defense. Dragon Claw. And kill. Okay, cool. Woo. That's why we got Kato. Okay, so Salamence goes down. That thing is a huge threat. I'm very happy that's gone. So now, I think he might bring in Clefairy because that thing doesn't get affected by the Toxic. <clears throat> but I am special defensive, so I don't know what he might do, actually. Let's see. Okay, hey, there's our mana tan. All right. Um. So. Hmm. Dar mana tan. What are you gonna do, brother? Let's go back into him on top. Actually, let's see. What might he do? Will he belly drum? Uh, I don't know, if he belly jumps though, he's going to give me two prey cows. Let's see. So we're going to lower his attack. Okay, Icicle Pass. Scarf, though. Alright, we're gonna go. Let's, let's try to figure out what item is. We're gonna go in here, we're gonna click Flash Cannon. Worst case scenario, he goes into like Rotom. The rocks really do suck right here, though. That was my spinner. That's. I do have Played All, but, uh. You know, I don't think I might get the opportunity to do that again. So let's just hit the flash cannon just in case. It should kill Incineroar, kill Clefairy. Um, he's gonna swap into probably Halucha or um, Rotom. There. Oh, okay. So we got a good hit right here. <laughs> we're just gonna hit it again, obviously respect. I really need to get my rocks out, man. 
But that's the thing, I need two turns on Claydol. Spin and rocks. Because Kyrium can't keep going in and out on these rocks. So he sacked his Clefairy. I think it was just a free free switch for either Darmanitan or Halucha. We'll see. Halucha. Yeah. I'm just gonna go straight back into him. If he hits me with the fire move, I'm dead. Alucha is definitely faster than my Glavantula. Drapion down. How do I want to deal with this thing? Revenge is gonna take a lot of damage to rocks. I'm gonna have to go Rillaboom and then fake out. And Grassy Glide. Alright. Fake out. Very nice. Oh. How do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? This is grassy glide kill. Let's see. Rillaboom. Into a Halucha. And his defense is minus one. I think we should kill. With life orb and max attack. I think he switches though. Yeah, he's gonna go into Incineroar probably. Go for the attack drop. So he swapped just so that he wouldn't have that defense buff or uh, debuff. Okay, so he's back to neutral. In which case, Grassy Glide will not kill anymore. Nothing's really stopping him from going back into Halucha again. We'll figure out if he's Scarf. I mean, if, if I don't think Levantula takes one. Maybe he misses this Icicle Crash. That'd be clutch, but we'll see. Yeah, I'm not with him. <laughs> I'm not with him. The rocks, for sure.
Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, into Rillaboom. No, that was bad, because my terrain's gonna go down. Fudge. I'm gonna U-turn. I mean, fake out, sorry. Back into Rotom, right? I'm just gonna grasp it back. I gotta go for it. Okay, roll him down. This is good, because now I can slack my, uh, slack. Stack my clay doll, worst case scenario. Back into really doing a fake out. I really should have got out rocks instead, but I needed to hit Ice Beam. I couldn't risk. Fake out. Now we're gonna grassy glide. Very nice. Arm down. I think I have to sack. Hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I don't think Kirim's gonna hold a CC at half HP, guys. So. Yeah, not happening. <laughs> so, we are gonna have to sack Kirim. So, he's heavy duty boots because you can see that he didn't get poisoned. Not heavy duty, yeah. Hmm. Oh, he got a crit too. I mean, I died anyway. Wait, how did he not get closer? Am I missing something? Uh, 
I think I die no matter what here because of life orb. And if I live, imagine I get a crit on fake out. It's like, oh my god, I lived. This has to kill, actually. If this doesn't kill, we lose. Oh, we won! Woo! Yo, that was close. Yo, Rillaboom came clutch, guys. Holy. That was a GG, man. That was scary. <laughs> Yo, Life Orb, Grassy Glide coming in clutch. Oh man, that was scary. I kind of don't know how to report that though, because um, although I died in the end to Life Orb, I mean I won because I got the kill first. But uh, do I put it that Rillaboom survives in that scenario? I gotta figure it out. Yo, it was a fun match that was really close, guys. What a way to start off the league. Um, didn't get to do exactly what I hoped for, but I had to play. Oh, he's asking. Yeah, so I believe I do get a win. I'll figure it out, but uh, definitely a spicy match for week one, guys. Uh, GG's Coach Kamike. I'll see y'all in the next one.